Isn't it awesome to have a small display connected to your Arduino and display some messages to others? It will be much nicer if we could use the big old CRT TV laying around in your home by just one composite cable. And it seems it is possible. So let's see how to do it. First of all, you will need an Arduino and you will need to steal a composite cable from your grandparents TV. Just kidding. You will need a broken composite cable that you don't bother to cut and just two resistors of value 1 kilo ohm and 470 ohm. With the schematic that I found in the internet, I started making a simple circuit in a small puff board. The 1 kilo ohm resistor should get connected to pin 9 of the Arduino you know and the 470 ohm resistor should get connected to pin 7 of the Arduino you know. Then you are supposed to cut the connector at one end and strip it to reveal two wires, yellow being the signal wire and black being the ground. You must connect the ground wire to the ground of your Arduino and the signal wire to the junction where both 1 kilo ohm resistor and 470 ohm resistor meet in series, as you can see in the schematic. And that's it, you are done doing the circuit. Now you just need to connect your Arduino to your computer upload the code and you will definitely get an output well not for me though i did not get anything on my tv screen after scratching my head for a few minutes i realized that i have connected a 470 kilo ohm resistor instead of 470 ohm resistor god damn it murphy was at that time with me so i had to replace the resistor and I also made the circuit like a module so that the wire don't flap around in the breeze. Then all it's left is to upload the example code. If you want the example code, you can find it below in the description. First you will need to download the zip file and extract it on your computer and copy the files inside Arduino or CA to Arduino's library. For that you will need to go to documents, click Arduino file, click libraries file and paste the folders from the zip file in it. Then you can open Arduino IDE and go to example, scroll a little bit and you will find Arduino RCA. Move the cursor over it and you will find some example codes like demo NTSC, demo PAL, image. You may wonder what is NTSC and what is PAL? Well, they are both encoding used in composite video. But it does not matter as the TVs can switch between the encoding automatically. I uploaded the code to my Arduino and I finally got an image. You can also display your own custom images to your TV screen by just following the steps. First, find the desired image, in this case, an Apple logo. Everyone loves eating Apple, don't they? Now you will need to resize the image to 96 into 96 pixels as it is the largest image supported by the Arduino code.
then you will just need to save the changes to the image then you must open a website that is given in the description of this video there you must upload your image and you must tweak some little changes to get a nice looking image on a screen after doing that scroll down a little bit and you will find generate code once you hit it you will get a big set of values the values you see are the values of the image instead of seeing an image you are seeing the image as binary and hexadecimal values you will need to copy these values and paste it inside the code called image you can see how i did it here then you can upload the code to your arduino and wait for the tv to show an image that's it i think it is a good project because you can display a lot of information in a big tv instead of being confined to those small oled displays that cost a fortune they are not cheap actually but you can just use her the tv that's laying around in your home for free so i hope you enjoyed this video stay creative and i will see you next time